What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another episode of Watch Dog Legion. And it's it. Last time. Oh, let me see. Last time we were doing Into the Void. But I figured out there's actually two missions here. So we're gonna do this one. I hate putting Mary Kelly on the back burner while she continues to destroy lives with those microchips, but for now, we've no choice. Then perhaps it's time to have a closer look at the elephants in the room. Nigel, Cass, billionaire warmonger and current CEO of our local horde of thugs, Albion BMC. Cass certainly profited most from the bombings. We can inspire London to resist from now till forever, but it still won't break Albion's grip on the city. Not with Cass at the top. You what? Are you saying we gotta go after the man in control of all of them mercs, goose stepping across London? That man will fry us the minute we get close to him. Bagley's come across a possible gap in Cass's armor. An ex-insider, ex-friend with an axe to grind. He'd be an asset if we can find and convince him to work with us. Come to the safe house. We'll talk it through. Okay, we're, okay. Mine is that. We don't have our medic anymore because I didn't think he was really all that. But then I realized when someone gets injured, their time of healing is less when you have a medic. Also, we have this guy. Alright, let's attend to this. What the hell are they talking about? Okay, that's Thomas. Where is he? Yo, Roger, you seen the new guy? I don't see him anywhere. Also, I set her outfit back to normal. I designed freaking Roger. Schniz, where's the other guy? Yeah, I forget. Let me just see his name real quick. Yeah, yeah, okay. His name is Timothy. Alright, let's start this meeting, or briefing. Team briefing. Let's talk about Albion PMC, the only British organization to successfully oppress more in the developing world than the British government. Led by Nigel Cass, a man the partisan media calls a charismatic visionary, and Amnesty International calls a war criminal. Albion was given the key to the city to re-establish order following the bombings. Which is fucked up. Just saying. It is. So that's two reasons why we need to find an angle on Cass. We found one. His name? Hamish Bellagi. Born in London, Bellagi was a recipient of the Cass Foundation Technical Scholarship at 14, which included a mentorship with Cass himself. At 16, Bellagi designed Cass's first drone fleet. Fun fact, Cass delayed the launch by a week so it would land on Bellagi's birthday. Cass sounds like Bellagi's second dad. Why would he help us? They had a falling out after an incident in the night at Delta three years ago. A buried human rights investigation accuses Cass of ordering a drone fleet to wipe out a village protesting the construction of a pipeline, but the drones malfunctioned before they could. Bellagi is named as the likely saboteur. He's been on the run ever since, but now tracking data shows he's reappeared in London. Shit, he's looking for redemption like with the protesters. This guy designed Cass's drone fleet. I think he's trying to disarm Albion. He covers his tracks that's well, but that's good. a good guess. Unfortunately, according to this Albion intelligence report intercepted by our friend Caitlin Lau, Cass knows Bellagi's in London as well. So, that's the op. Make contact with Bellagi before Albion finds him. Then convince him we have a mutual enemy in Cass. So this guy's our someone's best really chance to stop Albion and I just now decided to perform someone's congress. The largest private army on Earth wants him dead. No pressure. It took My some luck. doing, but I've narrowed down the area where we're most likely to find Hamish Bellagi. I've pushed the coordinates to your optic. I'll meet you guys there. Bellagi has been snooping into Albion's affairs. Quietly, of course, but I've been able to determine that most of his activity stems from this area. Let's knock down his door then, yeah? Not so fast. Hamish isn't in, according to his home security. And before you get ideas, he's rigged his front door to a series of traps designed to delete all of his data and then your life. Not necessarily in that order. Got a similar setup myself. 
Maybe paranoid, but... To be fair, you are an armed insurgent trying to break into his flat. Anyway, you should be able to connect to the local grid and use security cameras to disarm his traps. Got it. His traps? Is that a way for me to climb up? That'd be sick. I believe the main interface is on the rooftop. Bugsy boy, how about the windows up there? Access point, maybe? Sure, if you can get there. Three options here. One, use the window washing platform. Two, find a cargo drone. Three, give up, go home, and resolve to be a better person. On it. Cool, another one of these. I wonder what's gonna be this time. What the oh, hell? That fam. Full trap set up, yeah? You could force the traps to unlock by rewiring the power. On it. This dude playing. Welcome to Claire and Present Danger, and welcome to Fascist London. Don't let that boot on the back of your neck disturb you. In time, you'll barely feel it. We have to wake up people. If there was a playbook for setting up a totalitarian police state, Albion would be most of the way through it and working on the epilogue. They certainly took advantage of the fallout from the bombings, didn't they? Preyed on the fears of the city government, too. They were only too happy to hand Nigel Cass the keys to the city. Wash the hands to the whole mess. The collar will only get tighter now, friends, unless we do something. We can't wait for someone else to fight back. We are the change. Oh, I got it. The traps are disarmed. Now, if you go through the front door of the flat, it's much less likely you'll be killed. <sighs> I'm not editing none of that out. Man's had the shotgun ready. Okay, I have to go anywhere. I just jump off this building. So are we just staring at each other like freaks?
Move! One more muscle, chief, and I'll blow the whole place with you in it. All right, bruv, just relax. Who the fuck are you? And what are you doing in my flat? You with Albion? You what, mate? Nah, I think resistance. What, dead sec? Yeah, right, and I'm Che Guevara. You're done. You're done. Listen to me, listen. Look, Albion knows you're in London. You've got to run, you fucking idiot. Fuck me. You're telling the truth, aren't you? <sighs> Fucking hell, thought I was careful. Fucking idiot, Amish. Look, cuss is worse than you know. Yeah, bro, I know. I know, like, I mean, what do you think I came here for, man? Maybe, because Nigel Cass is paying you. That's how fucking Merck's work. Yo, look, I'm here to get your help. We want to take down Cass. Look, he started all the bombings, and then he tried fucking ending us. Mate, you don't know shit. You have no idea what Cass is and what... Move, move, oh, move! Fuck! And I'll be in squads closing in on you. I guess you won't mind about that part. Fuck, think, think. Shoot, fine. We'll table it. I'll buy you some time. Just go. Shout out to the Oh, yeah. Don't tell me. Oh, shit. Shit. What the hell is that lag? Whoa, I'm out. There is so much. I can't even go this way. Oh, but I can go this way though. Wow, what a great way to go. Oh, man. Control, I've lost the target. Wow, this is the best getaway ever. I've done absolutely nothing. I was fucked. Control, put out an APW. Target is gone. I think all that excitement convinced our new friend Hamish that we need to work together to tackle Cass. He's willing to cooperate. Is he? Man seemed like a gangster too. Okay, inside Albion. Okay, let's... Come on, lay it on me. Alright, Chief. That was a pretty slick escape. I believe you. So I'll say this. Nigel is planning something. And I don't think I could stop him on my own. If dead sex everything I've heard, you'll help me. We can help each other. There's a chance Cass had something to do with the bombings. What could he be planning that's worse than that? No, no, that's not like him. Well, not exactly. See, Nigel's got to see himself as the hero. He's an arrogant twat, but he's not a cynic. Every place we go into, he... We would have some mad plan to fix all his problems. With robot police or automated crop fertilizer. This is the dude from Advanced Warfare. Called you Advanced Warfare. And people are just bugs in the software, you know? You work around them or you squash them. Sorry, Chief. I gotta switch proxy servers so they don't trace me. I'll hit you right back on voice. Listen, I've got an inside man, right? A contact in Albion. Says Nigel's got this big meeting happening at White Tower. He'll be talking about a major project he's got planned for life. He's an insider on the team. I've always wanted to be in on a caper. Okay, first things first. We'll need eyes on the impregnable target, so off you go. I'll crack on with assembling the right personnel to round out this ragtag bunch of misfits. Ah, shit. I'll be in cyber security sniffing my proxy IP. Must have traced the detonator signal. I've got to deal with this. What is... Why does every freaking guy in a video game with a private army or something looks exactly the same. It doesn't make sense. Wee! Yeah, that was a rough line though. Oh. Those are their, their security guys that they were random people. Um... Hmm. Bro, that's full tight security. Even for us. Gonna be hectic. I'd like to help, fam, but Nigel's just caught a whiff now. With all the CTOS cameras, it'd take him less than five to ID me. I ain't risking my pretty face. 
We need an Albion insider for our caper, one who's willing to turn coat. I've reached out to a contact who works in a nearby pub. Where better to find a bleakly disillusioned anti-hero numbing their conscience with drink, but secretly desperate for redemption? I've let our contact know what we're in the market for, and she's nearby. She's right in front of me. Alright, you lot certainly know how to pick your targets. You do know that Albion have set up their headquarters in there, right? And Cass is launching some new fucking project. Whatever it is, all of us are in big trouble. We have to do something, and this is all we've got. Fucking Nigel Cass. You're right. Nothing good can come of this. Luckily, I hear loads of sob stories working in a pub. And near this place, quite a few from Albion are dissatisfied with the status quo. You turn on the charm, and I'm sure you can get one to join the good guys. Even got a candidate in mind. Interesting. Send me their info, yeah? I'll have Bagley push it along. Good luck, love. Right now, that's done and diddly out of way. We're aware of an Albion employee who might be approachable. Recruit an Albion waste man. Sounds dumb as fuck. They're jackbooted thugs who regularly murder civilians. If finding a disenchanted employee is really that difficult, humanity is much worse off than I thought. It would also be quite useful to have someone on the inside. For however long that lasts, oh. Nigel's real good at sniffing out spies. Personal experience speaking. Yeah, not really in a sharing mood right now, fam. Legit, last night, before before the next day when I was going to record this, I was thinking about recruiting a guard, but I needed an upgrade for that, so I decided not to do it yet. But now we're going to recruit a guard for a mission. It's pretty crazy. I just went in a dumbass circle. <laughs> well, it wasn't one of these guards, but still a guard. Ooh, is she your sister? Your hench, mate. I think you got what it takes to save London. Are you with Dead Tech? Because I could use your assistance. Maybe, if we're not too busy. What's up? My friend has a rare medical condition. Unfortunately, with the NHS in disarray, they haven't been able to get treatment in months. We were out of options until this clan Kelly doctor said they'd help for a price. I didn't know what else to do, so I paid them. Keep talking. That bastard. The drugs worked, but it turned out they were addictive. The second my friend was hooked, the doctor inflated the price. I'm sorry, blood, but look, don't worry. We'll do whatever we got to do to help your mate. Okay. Renee. Well, this quote unquote doctor is a real winner. He was struck off the medical register for gross malpractice last year, and now he's a freelance mob surgeon. Nice work if you can get it. You set to track him down, Max? I am quite literally always tracking everyone down. Pushing you with coordinates now. Suspect <clears throat> reported in your area. Potentially armed and hostile. <clears throat> She's ran over his Proceed. butt, man. Stand by for further developments. Can anyone see the suspect? I I turned them off, did I not? Let me get up on this bridge. All these damn fucking drones and shit. Suspect is unsighted, unsighted sweeping area. If I would have hit that checkpoint, would have been over. You know, use cops way easier in this game. Control. You do and get that auto. I don't know, Core Connect Challenge or whatever that's in. The Clan Kelly doctor you're looking for is close by. Seems he's got a laptop with him too. Presumably with a folder somewhere on it labeled Crimes. Ah, oh, damn, that would've been slick. I gotta There's do that. the laptop.
Oh shit. Get to safety while I analyze the data. Booyah. I am out of there. This is a nice car. I found them a warehouse where experimental drugs are being stored. I'm sure Mary Kelly won't mind if you nick a few. Okay. Hey, can I even get in from over here? No. Son of a bitch. That's not what I want to do. I'm detecting a vehicle nearby with at least two years worth of treatments inside. That's more than enough to wean our contact's friend off the treatment. Got it. I'm thinking about one of those guys, but. Yeah, fucking tardy motherfuckers! Motherfuckers. Sit the fuck down! Oh, what? The authorities are on my ass? Nothing fucking new. This is how it is with you lot, yeah? Until you lose them, yes. Alright, guys, I am now eating boneless wings. Plain bonus wings with two different barbecue sauces, sweet and spicy barbecue sauce, and Hawaiian barbecue sauce with a nice strawberry lemonade. Beautiful strawberry lemonade, and I have to try and lose this guy. <laughs> I'm built different. Oh, it's the old it's the old guy I met yesterday. I can't even There's the vehicle with the drugs in it. Try not to destroy it. Easy. Got the ride, now what? I found a safe location where our friend can pick it up. Sending you the coordinates now. Crash. I done what you said. We have the location of the drugs too. We'll send the deets along. Your mate will be sorted, yeah? Anyway, I owe you a favor now. Hey, our squad always needs new blood. You in? Fine. I'm in. I'm sorry for chewing very loudly into your ears. This is new. No, wait, no, I've already checked with him. We have an Albion operative on our roster. We should let them know they're needed. You are obliged to follow any and all directives from Albion personnel. It is a failure to do so. She got a whole element G on her. We've been needing talent like you, cuz. Glad you joined the fight. Yes, well, I'm ready to help however I can. Fuck yeah. Nigel Cass's meeting will begin soon. Approach the Tower of London when you're ready. Okay. <clears throat> you know what? I'm gonna just fast travel. <clears throat> I can drive this vehicle like this? From the back? No boss. I'm pretty sure I can just walk in there. If we're lucky, word hasn't spread that you've hung up your jack boots. Just try to put on your meek, harmless, broken by the system face. Oh, and don't forget your uniform. I am wearing my uniform. Can I just walk in there?
Yo, cuz, let me in. Come on, man. Okay, he's not gonna let me in. We're just gonna close this right by shot. Looking sharp. Your ex colleagues won't pay any attention to you unless you let them take a close look. What does that mean? Just tell him I freaking stop working for him. Because I'm, I mean, I'm. Unless there's something I don't know. That. If they just look at me closely. Disturbance detected. Beginning investigation. Yo, what is he on? What is this drone on? Yo, these drones can see right. Mother freaker. Like, I ain't even do anything. It's just a black woman security guard walking. This could have gone so much more smoother. I don't get it. How? I'm letting that thing spray! That the one who kept diverting relief supplies away from the barrack to keep everyone in line for Albion. These days, you could do a lot more evil with a spreadsheet than a drone fleet. Well, that's just great. I didn't even do anything, bruh. Oh, sweet Jesus. Like, I, I have not been a mission stealthy yet. Is that so much to ask for? Oh my god! What else was I supposed to do? Just fucking... I don't get it. I was just walking. Dead sex resources certainly make this easier. I need to upgrade so I can hack these drones. Spraying that LMG. Run that LMG. L LMG spray. That shit is beautiful. And it felt so good. It'll all take us like three shots if we can kill him. you on our team glad to have you yes well i'm ready to help however i can <laughs> glad to hear it if we're lucky word hasn't spread that you've hung up your jack boots just try to put on your meek harmless broken by the system face oh and don't forget your uniform right 
Resuming my normal duties. Looking sharp. Your ex-colleagues won't pay any attention to you unless you let them take a close look. Okay, so that's what that means. They can't they can't get near me, so he was right. And I kinda guessed. But how would they know that? That's that who trains them? Batman didn't train them. Tony Stark didn't train these guys. They're not they're not Avengers. Come on, man. Well, this gate's already open because I opened it, and that asshole isn't here no more. Let me go download this key card. Suspect thing. I'm doing good so far. Mate, please. Mate, please. I gotta wait for him to go back. Cause that's how we gotta be. Hey. Now he's going that way. Bro! Um, have I seen you before? Give up while he still can. Am I going to the building now? <laughs> I really should have just took him out real quick. That's what I should have done. Doesn't make no damn sense. A word of caution now we're inside. Any disturbance in here, and Nigel Cass will surely cancel his meeting. Avoid being detected by your former colleagues, or this operation is a bust. Nigel won't have anything important on this floor. You're quite knowledgeable about camps, aren't you? Yeah. I was Albion too, if you hadn't twigged to that. Me and Cass were close once. Looked up to him. <laughs> he was bigger than life, fam. Literally a tech genius. And I was just a gearhead kid. I wanted to be like him. That's why I joined up. Oh, for fuck's sake. Didn't find out he was a murderous prick until later. <sighs> Some guys he got here. Uh, like, like that. Suspicious. I'm not suspicious. Do you hear these guys? It's 
Stop it. Stop it. Stop! STOP! What the fuck?! Intruder alert! I think it's like a big fat cock. What am I doing wrong? I'm just walking! About to look up a whole fucking walkthrough by Jesus to see what the hell I have to do. This door clearly requires a security pass. Well, that's just great. Use one of the nearby computers to create your forgery. Be careful. You don't want to know what Nigel does with trespassers. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. <laughs> I don't understand. I'm just walking, bro. I this is ridiculous. How fast this mission gonna get skipped if I can't fucking do this shit? Cause it's bullshit. Intruder alert! Intruder alert! They better not be. It's just a bunch of terrorists pretending to have morals. This door clearly requires a security pass. Well, that's just great. Use one of the nearby computers to create your forgery. Be careful. You don't want to know what Nigel does with trespassers. He could be dead for all I know. He could be lying face down at the bottom of the table. Keeping up the Elliot Flat with that black green soft pass if he's seated at the club. It would work in the corner. It's a heavy move. You understand? Yeah, I know what you mean. But there's always an element that's going to resist doing this shite. Sure, but I thought we'd taken care of them long ago. I've heard some talk on the street that they may be back in operation. It'll take some time for the forgery to be ready. To keep you occupied, I dragged up still images and a recording from an internal investigation into Cass Senior's death. Show me. Internal psych assessment AS001, subject Cass Nigel. Mr. Cass experienced a deeply traumatic event when he witnessed the murder of his father, Gareth Cass, CEO of Albion. He began exhibiting symptoms soon after what he frequently described as the random event. Mr. Cass's initial symptoms included insomnia, paranoia, distorted blame, and recurring flashbacks. However, he appears to have channeled his anger and self-described powerlessness into his work to ensure that Albion become, quote, a mechanism for preventing unpredictable violence. It seems somewhat of a mania edging on psychosis. For me, this raises concerns about Mr. Cass's fitness to run a multinational security company, but, I cannot, at this time, make any recommendation beyond continued monitoring, especially considering that I have been asked to close this file. Grand. They put someone incapable of processing their emotional baggage in charge of our security. Just grand. Yeah, well, Nigel's never close to anyone but his dad. And me, I guess. Never had much faith in people, really. Well, the pass is ready, but rough. If this resistance thing doesn't work out, I doubt you'll make a living as a document forger. Let's give it a go anyway. Nigel Cass awaits. Dude, I freaking hate this mission. This has to be the stupidest mission in the whole game. I don't even know how far away I am from being this. They can't. They can't see a woman as a security guard? I think that's why I keep getting freaking... Freaking detected, because I'm a woman. Yes. These guys are sexist. This game is sexist. <laughs> fucking awful. Seems a bit tense. What? How are you getting on with those metrics? The deadline is coming up quick. We wouldn't do 
Bro, leave me the fuck alone. I know, I know, but if I mess this up, then the whole project is delayed for I don't know. Damn. Don't even joke about it. I don't even want to think about what directed happened. Just, just make sure you get it done. On the <laughs> Nigga, move away from me. Stand down, you. Intruder alert. You see, Intruder you see, you see, you see what I'm talking about? Oh my. Oh my god, this mission. This game sucks balls! Welcome to Project Themis. Our new autonomous drones. These drones can identify, isolate, and terminate threats. I before fucking deserve to chew in your guys' they ears. Can do harm. They can go anywhere. See everything. They could kill a man alone in an alley, or in a crowd of hundreds, with perfect precision. Themis drones can do what humans have always struggled to. Tell me some Terminator shit, man. Act. Immediately and decisively. Without your support, I couldn't stand here and tell you. But I promise you, with the launch of Project Themis, London will be the first city in the world to be made truly safe. Mr. Cass, I was hoping you called us all in here today to discuss the ethical issues. No, it's all right. The commissioner cares. Murmurs at disapproval. I admire his I disapprove this goddamn mission. Let's talk ethics. Well, for one, Themis goes far beyond Albion's mandate. We really should have more government consultation. I see. Delay the launch so that we can debate and assess the details. We're missing the human element here. I can get the defense minister on the line right now. Well, if you feel you must. <gasps> well, I... It's the human element that got us into this. Sir, what was that? Oh, it was just me shooting a gun. Oh, okay. Decision. Understand this. I will not allow anyone, not even myself, to jeopardize Themis. I do like Byron now, Saxon. Will our friends at Tidus be ready? You are the cornerstone of the project after all. Do you need to consult any outside parties? Uh... No, we'll be ready. And just in time. Criminals running our streets. Illegals threatening our families. The police commissioner himself. Assassinated by terrorists. Dude, is this room is soundproof or they just... Decisiveness the is hard. But they care about but my black ass. Part. Once this decision is made, no more will be required of you. So I figured out what I was doing wrong. I just had to hijack the camera and attract the guy. I warned you about that forgery. Your He's uniform enough. will help. Don't let them get a close look at you. Bagley, I need an exit. Quickly! The catacombs, fam. Damn, bitch. Yeah, there's no way I was escaping. This place fucking undetected. 
Cause this shit doesn't make sense. All they gotta do is look at you and they figure out it's you. Shit triggers me, gosh. So this dumbass motherfucker didn't hear that shit. Those are terrible security guards. Let's probably just whack both of them. Dog shit ass security. Bro, just leave me alone. I ain't even know how to that. I ain't, I ain't even know how to come down. So I liked your action in there, didn't you? Man can be very uh, persuasive. He knows how to get his way. And he wants this Themis project launched post haste. I doubt that's good news for London. Yeah, intense chewing. Okay. It's a little maze. Kinda. Kinda remind me of Resident Evil. Honey, you might want to pull out your gun. Because I'm not having a great vibe to this. Ooh, look, points. Shit. Oh my god. Ooh, look, more points. I don't like this at all. I don't either. Okay, I just have to keep going down. Goodness, this is creepy. What is all that noise? My homie Bagley can't even talk to me. What was that? Is there a monster down here? You guys can see my face right now. Oh, I'm Fucking out like hell. that. Albion's top secret project is an automated killing machine. And it looks like Cass is almost ready to launch. We have to get Themis out of his hands. I'll prepare a briefing. Will we see you there, Hamish? Pretty face, not risking, remember? But patch me in. You and me got some scheming to do, Bagley. Yeah, you're not pretty dude. Pause. I am in an episode right here after that. Holy crap, man. I was kind of freaking furious after that. What are you even looking for? Your somewhat reckless teammate has got themselves thrown in the old clink, I'm afraid. Difficult to resist a pressure what? from behind bars. It will be a while before they're available. Pro tip, however, why not recruit a barrister to the team? I mean, no one exactly likes a barrister, but they do have their function. They should be able to shorten the jail time of imprisoned operatives. I'm sorry, who's in jail? None of us are in jail. What is that? Esports player. I'm sorry, what the hell are you talking about, Bagley? None of us are in jail. No, we can't clear this up peacefully. Yes, dude. My hands are up, don't shoot. That's fucked up. But I will see you guys in the next one.